Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Let's get started on this week's video. My printer box has been taking up unnecessary space, so I decided to make something useful of it. So I'm going to start off by spray painting it with my black semi-gloss spray paint that I purchased from Home Depot. And I'm basically focused on spray painting the outer perimeter. I didn't fully spray paint the bottom because the bottom will not be showing. So now I'm just going to hot glue the top down. Now I'm using this poster board to cover up my box. I'm aligning my poster board with my box before cutting it and I'm also making sure that you can still see the edges. The cutout wasn't as straight as I wanted it to be, so that's why I am now using this ruler to make the edges as straight as possible. Of course, you can just draw a line and then cut it out that way, but I just chose to do it this way. Now I'm using another poster board so I can trace and cut out a second piece. I'm completing the same exact steps for the sad pieces. Now it's time to glue everything down and I'm making sure that the glossy side is facing upwards. If you are going to recreate this and you want this to last over time, I suggest using a stronger adhesive. This is the bottom and this is what the rest of my box is looking like and I didn't have a big enough piece to fully cover the top and I mistakenly put glue on the outer part but that's okay because that will be covered up. I'm covering the edges with my silver beaded necklaces for decoration and the necklaces will also make the poster boards appear more straighter around the edges. I'm putting all the bowls into place before gluing them down. I use 20 bowls on the front and back side, totaling to 40 bowls. This is the bottom part, that's why it's not covered up. And this is the front side and this is the back side. Now I'm placing a strip of my silver metallic tape on the sides and also the top. I'm using some of this adhesive diamond wrap to make it more glam. And if you wanted to use mostly Dollar Tree items, you can simply use some of this pearl wrap or the bling wrap. If you are going to purchase this bling wrap, just a heads up. I had a little trouble cutting it because it's a little thick. This is the top part of my box and I'm just covering up this area and also the bottom. If you are wondering, this bling wrap adheres very well. So now that the box is finished, I'm gluing all three of these bowls together. I'm adding these necklaces to cover up the excess glue.
I'm gluing these bowls right to the top of my box and then I'm going to add more glue so I can have the excess glue with these vase fillers that I purchased from Dollar Tree. This is how it all turned out. This is a perfume bottle that can also be used as a table in a glam room. Comment below and let me know what y'all think. For this second project, I'm starting off by using the bigger bowl in this gold metallic tape that I purchased from Amazon. I'm placing the tape in the center and then following the lines along the four corners. I'm placing another piece of tape in between each of those four corners. For this next step, I'm placing a piece of tape around the top and also the middle of these candle holders. I completed the same exact steps for my smaller bowl and now I'm going to take the clear jewel border stickers and cover just the center piece of tape. These stickers are self-adhesive and if you plan on recreating this then I suggest you add some glue so they can stick over time. I glued the second candle holder on top and now I'm gluing the mirror on top of the candle holder. I'm adding a strip of tape along the center to cover up the excess glue. These are the acrylic gems from Dollar Tree and I'm just going to fill the bowl up. I'm just placing a couple pieces of tape on top of my mirror so that way once I place my flowers down they can stay put and also if I decide to place a candle or anything else on the top I can do so easily. Look how gorgeous this turned out. This is a perfect piece for weddings or your everyday home decor. Comment below and let me know what y'all think. 